This is Nellie Deutsch and today I'm going to show you how to copy a form. I try to save time so I use uh, forms, reuse them over and over again instead of creating new ones. So I'd like to create a form. I don't have much time for it because I'm adding it to a course and I'm in the process of creating the course on Moodle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply make a copy very easy very efficient and then I can make all the changes that I want so click on make a copy and then I'm going to give it another title because here it's not called free online events on Moodle it's going to be called and of course it is free because everything on Moodle for teachers is free but this is a course for advanced learners of Moodle who'd like to become managers of a Moodle site. So this is the course that I just started. It's called the manager of a Moodle site and I'm going to add the form. So here I go with the changes that I'd like to make on the form. So the name of the course is of site. Okay, uh, I'm going to, I guess, share it with the same people. It's public, but all right. So there goes, it's uh, being copied. Wait a few seconds, depending on your connection, of course. And there it is. Okay, I might want to change um, the header here, the image. It says the folder containing responses to follow up questions can't be found. This form won't resume collecting. Okay, of course not. All right, so um, I'm going to change the folder and the response area. Let me do that by opening it up. And notice, create a new spreadsheet. Okay, definitely create a new one. And um, go on to get the link. Let's go back to the uh, form, okay, which is right here. I'm going to go to the live form. But actually, I'm going to go into send because that's all I need. I need the link it's going to give me the same page. Okay, so let's go into the send. Here we are. And click on the link. Okay, make it shorter. Otherwise, there's some problems with it on the Moodle. It just gives um, lots of errors. There, I've copied it. Now I'm going to go back to the course. So bear with. So here I am back in the course. Paste it. Activate it open a new window which I like to do and before we go let me just copy this because I'll need this information and save and display all right so let's go back to the form and on the form we are going to add the description because this description is not what we want all right so let me move myself over there so uh, the description will read the following. Oops, there we go. Let's just scroll down a bit. Manager of Moodle side course is a four week training course for advanced learners of Moodle. The course includes, okay, advanced learners who receive, okay, let's just, the site, okay. The course takes place, All right. I think um, that's good enough for now. Okay, so that's what I'm going to have. And it's on my Moodle course over here. Ah, uh, yes, this is um, the site, Moodle for Teachers Training. Or at least one of them. I've got two of them. And that's it. I hope this has been of help. And uh, you join. Okay, uh, this new course called Manager of a Moodle Site. Okay, it's not up yet. It's going to be up very soon. So right now, that's just what I have. Obviously, the course is not going to be here, so it's just going to be a registration area. Thank you for watching. And let me know if you have any questions. And of course, if you'd like to join the training, you're welcome to join. There's a preview of what you have to fill in, fill it in, and join us in the Moodle training course. Notice here I have the wrong title. 
have to change that. So uh, let's go back here at the bottom. Let me show you where it is. That's really, really important to make sure that everything is ready. If it's not, you can always edit. So the name of the course is Manager of a Moodle Site. So let's change that to... So before you do anything, remember, subscribe to my channel now. I really appreciate that. Thank you and have a great day.